We've seen buyers from BC and Ontario moving to Alberta in droves to avoid a housing situation where they'll be renting indefinitely due to the high, high cost of housing. With the average price of a home in BC or Ontario currently being just under a million dollars, finding out that the average cost of a home in Alberta is just under half a million dollars is music to these buyers' ears. This lower cost of home ownership also means a higher quality of life for these Canadian buyers. My name is Katie Crawford and speaking as someone who moved from BC 15 years ago to upgrade my own lifestyle, I'm going to tell you some of the non-financial benefits of being an Edmontonian. What I personally noticed when I moved to the Edmonton area in 2007 is that I still had all of the big city amenities at my disposal like top-notch restaurants, concerts, sports, shopping and festivals but all with that small town feel that comes with super friendly people. The people in Edmonton are very down to earth and it's easy to create a community for yourself here. Speaking of festivals, Edmonton's nickname is Festival City because of the 50 plus festivals that are held here every year. The longer winter means that when the sun's out, people love to live it up. Not that the sun isn't out in the winter, we actually get an average of 321 days of sun per year, which is great for the mental health. And yes, it may be colder than BC and Ontario, but the dry cold is much easier to bear. It's hard to explain unless you've experienced it yourself, but you'll see when you come visit. The North Saskatchewan River runs right through the city of Edmonton and the River Valley boasts 7,400 hectares of land equaling 22 times the size of Central Park in New York. There's a tremendous amount of green space in the city with 43 dog parks and hundreds of kilometers of walking trails. West Edmonton Mall, North America's largest shopping mall, has every store you can think of, an amusement park, water park, restaurants, two food courts, a casino, a hotel, all on site, plus more. It's a great place for an outing with your family. Depending on what area you live in, Edmonton is only about three to four hours away from Banff and Jasper National Parks with absolutely breathtaking sights and tons of outdoor activities to do both in the summer and in the winter. These are just a few of my favorite things about living in the greater Edmonton area. Are you considering a move? Check out my previous video on the cost of housing in the greater Edmonton area as compared with Vancouver and Toronto. I'd also love to hear about your plans. Send me a message and let's plan your move to Edmonton.